Hello world, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to CodingScientist.com. All right, guys. So, Coding Scientist is a platform to learn coding, robotics, and artificial intelligence for anyone between 8 to 80. So, this is a special series of tutorials where we would be covering a detailed aspects of robotics and artificial intelligence on nvidia jets and nano using jetpot all right so i'm sure many of you would have explored different kind of options to build your own jetbot there are multiple kits available in the market uh, and I'm sure you would have gone through uh, several, several aspects from Google and stuff like that. And also NVIDIA has got a couple of tutorials. However, in this tutorial, it's going to be for absolute beginners, people who haven't seen any kind of artificial intelligence applications or even, uh, you know, have any idea about programming in Python or C, C++ or any of the electronic components or embedded uh, devices, right? So this is going to be for absolute beginners and we are going to release each and every video tutorial in detail hands on. All right, guys. So before I get into further details, let me just talk about give a short introduction about myself. I am Anbu Kumar and I am the founder of Coding Scientist uh, platform and this tutorial I am going to be your personal mentor. I am going to walk you through each and every aspects of this particular tutorial series on Jetbot using NVIDIA Jets and Nano. All right. So uh, just to give you a quick background, I have about 23 years of experience in the software industry and I have worked with various multinational companies like IBM, HP, NetApp and a couple of others, both India and in US. Now. To give you a brief about my individual experience on embedded, I have intensively worked on embedded electronics, especially on Jetson Nano and Jetson Xavier and Xavier and AGX uh, modules, and also different kind of electronics and sensors and stuff like that. I have personally experienced building artificial intelligence applications and deployed that into a robot. Either it can be autonomous robot or a controlled robot. So I have pretty good hands on into all these aspects. Of course, I'm, I'm not an expert like unlike others in the world, but I do know where to look for and how to troubleshoot and how to configure and how to set up the systems and everything. So that's, that's what it's going to be the real fun. So guys, let me just give you a quick overview about the objective of this particular tutorial series. This is going to be for absolute zero to hero all right so that means literally very less theory and more of practical i am going to walk you through systematically letter by letter and syntax by syntax and show you how to plug in each and every components of jetbot and make things work this is going to be absolutely hands-on approach all right and let me also give you a pretty high level overview of what kind of skills you are going to develop one of course on the artificial intelligence side and two you are going to build your skills on robotics vision where your robot is going to view certain aspects of the environment and detect and send information and also you will get pretty good hands-on into uh, uh, nvidia's jets and nano board which is what we will be using in this particular tutorial series and also you will get experience in Linux operating system, which is the most important aspects apart from the Python programming that's going to be touched upon in this particular series. And let me also give you some bit of overview about what you're going to learn when you start building your artificial intelligence application. Of course, I will talk about in detail further but for now just just to give you a high level information you will be grabbing gathering data it's basically a collection of data and then you will do the classification of images that is when your jetbot is moving you will be capturing the images through either a jetbot camera or a separate camera connected to your jetson nano and then you will run image regression and then we will use some of the pre-trained neural network by nvidia and try to train our data right on that and then we will try to optimize the entire ai model and deploy that back into Jetson Nano on the Jetbot. All right, so that's what you will be learning 
step by step systematically hands on all right no theory it's going to be more of a practical now what is it you're going to learn about robotics vision so it is basically your 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 robot your your jet bot is going to get trained to follow a lane on the road right you, you would have seen the lane on the road so that's what we are going to train the bot and of course the training the robot to uh, detect different types of objects on its path so that it also uh, sends you information in terms of what kind of object has been detected and either to either you can avoid the object or you can override it and that comes part of your data training right and this is also part of this particular exercise is going to be for you, you will make your jet bot to follow a road as well so end of this course typically you'll be building a kind of autonomous robot or or you can call it as a self driving car so that's where we will be leading to and uh, let me give you a glimpse about uh, jets and nano so you will get pretty much hands on into the jets and nano architecture and i will teach you how to do the configuration and setup of the operating system and do some basic settings and you know stuff like that so that's going to keep you things moving forward in addition to that we will have uh, another uh, session on linux uh, terminal commands because guys this is very important right you will be using linux operating system on jetson nano so when you talk about robotics and artificial intelligence and you know building your own algorithms the os has to be linux of course you may choose to work on windows operating system as well but linux is the most preferred one it's more easy though it might be a little confusing initially for the beginners but do not worry i will walk you through step by step right and you will learn some of the important uh, terminal commands and stuff like that so that's what is going to be covered plus of course we will be covering a bit of python uh, programming uh, especially i will show you what kind of libraries will be used how to download those libraries how to compile and you know, compile those binaries and make those libraries to work with your python code and also some specialized coding for robotics aspects so we will be using both python as well as c c++ to a certain extent so this is a pretty much high level information about this particular uh, course and you will get a entire detailed end to end that's why we call it as a you know a zero to hero series which you would have seen in my previous uh, sessions in uh, youtube and uh, in my uh, coding scientist channel as well so guys stay tuned i am going to come back to you from the scratch from the beginning most important thing guys i want to just give you a highlight about this particular tutorial uh, the videos what i am going to make and build is going to be part of partial text and a very short video each video probably it may not be more than say about three to four minutes because people get bored looking at a long lengthy video so our goal is to make sure that you get short lessons and at the same time over a period of time you get pretty much hands-on into every topic you learn so that's it for now do stay tuned do log into codingscientist.com and register yourself and opt for this course it's going to be very interesting it's a one of a kind and i will look forward to helping you guys goodbye bye bye